Okay, a couple words about how we, how this thing stays on. The, the Glock system, all you 43 under, 43 users understand how that locking sub four plate business works on the 43, so I won't waste your time with that. Uh, well, on our system, we get rid of all of the internal, the internals, locking the sub four plate, and uh, we replace that with a 440 socket head screw. That guy. I don't know if the camera can reach it or not, but you'll see what I'm, what I'm trying to accomplish as I run that screw in. The screw reaches up inside the front lip of the magazine, which is flared at the factory by Glock, and produces this large, and we, we're working this large piece of steel up in there in order to solidly hold the, hold the magazine in place. The big advantage of this is it's completely gone from, the, from an outside perspective. You can't see it, you can't touch it, but if you feel it come up up here where you can see it, you know it's loose. So there's a, there isn't any question about whether whether the screw is tight or whether the screw is not tight. Once you've dogged it down, if it moves at all, as far as coming up where you can see it, you know something's wrong. So we end up with very positive retention, uh, but it's only a single screw. Once you put it on there, it's, there's not a lot of need to take it on and off. If you need to take it on, back on and off to clean it, it's really a piece of cake to do. And that's it.